Our world is exciting and mysterious. I share my stories of my adventures with you. Welcome to Igor Travels the World. So one of the things you should definitely do in the summertime in Prague is come out to the street food festivals. Uh, the one we're currently going to is called Naplavka Street Food Volume 2. Uh, they typically have them, well I think in the summertime it feels like kind of every other week or so. Uh, you'll get a range of food from Middle Eastern to Asian uh, to, you know, Mediterranean, former Russian kind of, uh, Asiatic, all kinds of stuff. So we're going to jump in there and, oops, we're going to jump in there and I'll show you what it's all about. The average price for one of these festivals is about 24 to 75 crowns, $1 to $3. Oh, thank you. Here we are, we're trying black corn juice. Never saw this before. Alright, so what do you think? It's delicious? It's really delicious. It's such a sweet. It's very refreshing. Let me try. Alright, so. You're right, it's got some sweet flavor, but not like sugary sweet. I'm finishing this too, right? No. Okay, so we're eating souvlaki and tzatziki, which is Greek food. What do you think? Mm. You like it? Okay. It's okay. Mm. It's really good, right? Mm -hmm. Chicken is soft. The tzatziki, tzatziki sauce is good. Tzatziki. Tzatziki sauce is good. It's very Greek like food. That's one of our next trips. Greece. Okay, so now here we got some Moroccan uh, food. We have chicken tagine, if I said that correctly, and Moroccan tea. So let's have Natasha try the chicken. What do you think? It's good? It is good. It's a little bit too much oil in my face. Uh -huh, it's a little too oily, she says. But the sauce is really nice. The sauce is nice. Let's give it a try. Mm. Definitely been boiled right. It's very soft. You're right, it's a little bit oily, but the sauce is nice. It's, it almost tastes like a potato sauce. Mm. Mm. So here we are, we're getting sugarcane juice. Last time I had this, I was in Peru or Colombia. I can't remember. Oh, fantastic. Decree. While you're strolling on that side of the river, make sure to drop by the swans. They're really people friendly. You can feed them. It's just a nice little added bonus. <laughs> 